Hey guys, welcome back. So, as you know, I've been going through a bit of a, a manga renaissance lately and I've been ordering a lot of books online. I just got my credit card bill yesterday. Damn, that was a shock. But hey, that's what you get when you go shopping all the time, right? Amazon, my best friend. So anyway, I just want to show off a couple of the mangas that turned up over the last week or so. Um, I do have a couple boxes to unbox here, but most of them I've I've already opened because I couldn't wait and they're just kind of like trickling in one at a time so I didn't know when I was going to get the chance to do another unboxing video so yeah I, I, I'm, I'm impatient I couldn't wait so the first three I'm going to show you are part of a collection I'm really dying to dive into the anime is on my radar as well so I'm really considering reacting to that on my channel but we have got the Vinland Saga so right here I've got book two four and five I've already got one and three and six I think out on the the shelf so that collection is steadily growing so what's attracted me to Vinland Saga covers like this guys I mean have a look at that can you see the artwork is absolutely astounding so when I first saw the animation for the the manga I was just like wow that looks so good and then of course the anime as well which you can find on YouTube is looking really enticing as well so I'm really kind of curious about the story of the Vikings and what this world is all about so that's book number two and then we've got book number four yeah good right I mean look at that that, that artwork on the front I mean my god it just looks insane and he's got some artwork some beautiful artwork inside there too so i'm very captivated by this story i want to i want to get into it so when i'm i'm currently reading a stephen king book on my ipad uh the institute which i, I really love it's i love stephen king he's one of my favorite authors so once i've finished reading my digital book in my ipad i'm going to start breaking in to the the hardcover mangas because damn i've got like 60 books already in my collection I go big, man. I go big and I go hard. So this is book number five. Once again, the artwork is just like, holy mama, look at this thing. Isn't it gorgeous? Are you guys reading Vinland Saga? I'm getting a lot of requests to check out the anime as well, so I'm definitely going to do that. And then you got the print inside. So, yeah, it's just... Oh, I've fallen in love with manga. I can't believe it took this long to get it into my life but damn I'm glad it's here finally and the other big V collection that I'm starting to get into now is also Vagabond so I've been checking out all the reviews for this series online too and hearing people's thoughts and feelings about it and once again it sounds like a really engrossing story about a samurai and it's got nothing but praise by people who've read it uh, I don't know if there's a series over this on, on anime though but um well I can't show that picture graphic like in like rude way <laughs> but as you can see the um the illustrations are just gotta be careful what i show man yeah the illustrations are just um absolutely stunning wow so i've got book one two three five and seven of these on the collection too and what i love about the spines is when you line them up all together they make an image so um that is beautiful way that they've done that these big big viz books are um, great there you go explicit content so don't put it all over the YouTube's guys and my last pickup from last week is uh, another box set and um yeah I was so I got Akira Ghost in the Shell and Alita Battle Angel so I've got the whole wall apparently I haven't got all of Alita Battle Angel as, as I've been told by the, the comment section but for a beginner like somebody just starting out with his manga collection I've got a pretty good haul there. So I've got those amazing box sets out there. And now I've got a new one to add. Tokyo Ghoul. Once again, I hear nothing but good things about this series. So, um, and uh, like I said, this is why my credit card bill was so high. I was just seeing all these m amazing deals. And yeah, I, I couldn't help myself. So I got all this. And like I said, I go on the recommendations of, of other YouTubers and I, I read comments as well so people were like really impressed by Tokyo Ghoul but not so much the anime right I hear season one is good of the anime but then season two not so I'm kind of debating if I watch that at all or if I'll just dive into the manga which I'm going to open now I didn't I've kept this sealed the last last four or five days because I did have an idea I'd put it on here at some point 
That was really loud. Okay, Tokyo Ghoul. I love the box set. Look at that animation on the front there as well. I mean, damn, so pretty. So that just lifts up there, I think. So, oh, it's held, down, it's held down by some um, Velcro tabs. That's cool. Oh, there we go. Opens down the front. Then you got, let me do that. I don't want to break it too soon. Just got it. I always break things when I first get them. Here we go. So all the um, all the additions there on the inside. Hot oh, damn. Volume 1 to 11. Tokyo Ghoul Complete Box Set. By Sui Ishida. Is that the author? The artist? Wow. Let's take a look at these. Oh, I'm loving these box sets, man. They're so good. The complete box set. I'm just getting everything in one, so I really hope I like the books. Because that'd be so awkward. Okay. Nice size, not too huge. Easy like most of the, the books I'm getting are the hard covers or the, the big viz, so I think this would be the or well, aside from um Death Note, the complete edition, this would be the smallest manga I've got, I think, like in in size. So that is our nice. Can you see the animation in there? I love me some really good supernatural tales. I love horror. I grew up reading horror comics from DC and grew up watching horror films, so I've got a real strong appreciation for it. I love J-horror. So anything that's supernatural and scary, I really get into it. Let's try and pull out the second book here. Take a ghoul, number two. Ghouls live on... Ghouls live among us the same as normal people in every way except they're craving for human flesh nice man I cannot wait I've got so much reading to do but damn what a great great way to spend the day right passing the time kicking back hot cup of tea a couple amazing mangas Tokyo Ghoul guys here it is so like I said, I'm kind of really trusting you guys out there because you're the ones who are recommending this to me. And my fascination with the format is just, it knows no bounds. So like I keep mentioning in my other videos, I'm just, the, the space thing where I'm going to put them is really kind of concerning, but I'll figure something out. I mean, I will, I hope. So I've got a couple boxes here as well. They arrived today. Oops. Number one. Uh, number two. Now I have kind of stopped ordering. Like I paid my credit card bill off yesterday, and I've I've not ordered anything. Well, since yesterday, but all the pre-orders and all the other things, I I have been going a little bit crazy over, over the last few weeks. So I wanted to kind of like complete my collections, and um yeah, like I said, go big or go home. First one from Amazon. trusty pull tab so I imagine oh, I've got two in here two books I'm glad they're um doing that rather than seeing them all individually oh here we go first one vagabond number seven there's so many collections there's so many books in all these collections there's like seven to twelve per per title and I'm like damn I've got to get them all just like Pokemon there's that spine on the side again. So it's uh, Tekihiko Inu. I don't know if I'm saying that right either. But, um, oh, God damn it! look at the animation there. Can you see that? It is so nice. Oh, I've got a, I've got a lot of, <laughs> I've got so much reading, but, oh, damn. Yeah. Who doesn't love manga, right? I mean, that's why you're here checking this little channel of mine out, right? Manga fans. That's number seven. Next. Oh, this is just like Christmas. Okay. Number eight. Coming together in one box. Astounding. Do you guys read Vagabond? Do you guys read Vinland Saga? Tell me what you think of it. Oh, please avoid spoilers. I don't need to know what's happening. I want to uncover these stories all by myself and just enjoy the hell out of it. 
And like uh, I think I asked a question before, does Vagapond have an anime? Because I'd be really curious to check it out. But um, yeah, I'm definitely going to check out the Vinland Saga anime. But should I check it out first or should I read the manga first? You know, you don't want to have all the spoilers if you're doing a reaction, right? Because if you know everything, it's not going to be quite a surprise to you. Oh, I think this is another um, another two books in this one. Excellent. I'll do the white bag. I really wish they put these in boxes, though. Like I said, um, one of my, uh, my previous openings, I pulled a book. I think it was uh, Vagabond number one out of one of these white paper bag things that, that Amazon sent me. Sorry about that. And there was a slight indentation on the cover. So when these kind of things come in the mail, they haven't got a lot of protection. Like it's padded, but not a lot to um, save it from, from any major impact or getting it out of the thing. What we got here? Wow, okay. All my vagabonds are turning up at once. This is number 12. Awesome, man. Viz signature. Number 12 is here. I've got to line these all up and see how the, how the spine looks when it's all, all together. Vagabond number 12, man. Oh, oh my god. This is, in, this is incredible. I Like I said, I have it eased off, so I'm just going to see if I can start reading these guys first before I dive into anything else, but I have got a few on my radar. Okay, Vagabond number 11. I do get a lot of suggestions from you guys out there. Uh, 20, 20th Century Boys is another big one that's kind of circling my radar right now as well. A lot of people seem to love that one too. There's that spine. Yeah. Explicit content. Let's see. Once again, the animation, like the drawing, the artwork is just so detailed. It is amazing. I've always had um, a really strong appreciation for comic books and stuff growing up as a kid. And manga is just next level, man. Oh my god. That's that's insane. So I, I don't think I've got all the mon the, the Vagabond mangas. I've still got a few of those coming. I'm going to put them out on the shelf in a minute and have a look. Might do a quick little shot of that while, while I'm out there. But um, Tokyo Ghoul, Vagabond... Vinland Saga. My collection is on point. Oh, another one that's circling my radar is, is as well as Monster. So let me know what you think about that one. Monster and 20th Century Boys. I'm not going to dive into it right away, but um, they're next in my, my saved list on Amazon. One day. These first, right? Damn. Anyway guys, hope you like that. Let me know about your favorite mangas down below. Catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching. <laughs>